Cats love to sleep and they sleep a lot. You're not imagining it. Cats are known to sleep between 15 and 20 hours a day. Why do they sleep so much? Do they dream while they are sleeping? Are cats just lazy or do they really need that much sleep? In this video, we're answering all of these questions and the truth about your cat's sleeping habits may surprise you. Cats nap for approximately two thirds of their lives. The majority of adult domestic cats average about 16 hours a day of sleep, but cats' sleep patterns change throughout their lives. Kittens younger than eight weeks old sleep over 20 hours a day due to the rapid growth and development taking place during this time. Cats over eight weeks of age sleep about the same amount of time as adults, approximately 16 hours, whereas senior cats over the age of 11 sleep closer to 20 hours each day. Cats sleep differently than humans, though. They don't sleep in long, straight stretches, but typically take naps off and on throughout a 24-hour period. This type of sleep pattern is referred to as polyphasic. Some cats snore. Snoring occurs more frequently in certain cat breeds, but any cat can snore if it's lying in the right position. If your cat's airway becomes partially obstructed by the skin on their soft palate, they will snore. This usually only happens when they are in a very deep sleep, and it's nothing to be concerned about. Himalayans and Persians are the two cat breeds who snore the most. Cats experience the same sleep patterns as humans. REM and non-REM sleep are two distinctive sleep phases that both humans and cats experience. This stands for rapid eye movement and non-rapid eye movement, respectively. REM sleep is the deepest, most restorative stage of sleep. People and animals who lack REM sleep will feel groggy and tired, even if they've had several hours of non-REM sleep. The more REM sleep one gets, the more energy they have. REM sleep can be distinguished from non-REM sleep in your cat because their eyes and ears will start twitching. This is also thought to be the sleep stage in which dreams occur. Weather can affect your cat's sleeping habits. Sunlight hours have a direct effect on how much your cat sleeps. Rainy, cloudy, or cold weather will make your cat sleepier than normal. If it's wet and gloomy outside, don't be surprised to see your cat yawning and napping more than usual. Cats also adjust their sleeping patterns according to the season. As natural hunters, they tend to stay awake more during times when food is plentiful, like summer and fall. These instincts remain alive and well, even in domestic house cats who don't need to hunt for their dinner. Temperature matters too. Cats don't like to hunt when it's too cold or too hot. When the mercury rises, cats prefer to spend their waking hours at night when it's cooler. This is the reason they are often mistaken for being nocturnal. Cats are crepuscular, not nocturnal. It's very possible that your cat's wild ancestors were nocturnal. Being active at night is a logical pattern that would allow cats to avoid predators and hunt for food, but we don't know for sure. What we do know is that domestic cats have a crepuscular activity pattern, meaning they are most active at dawn and dusk. While this activity pattern most likely developed to catch prey, it's also the time of day when indoor cats are most likely to be able to interact with their owners before and after work. Cats can engage in partial sleep. What does it mean to partial sleep? It means cats can fall asleep but be alert enough to flee at a moment's notice. Their smell and hearing remain active so they can stay on guard for danger. Cats don't sleep just anywhere. Cats have individual preferences on where they prefer to sleep. Some cats like cozy beds and others like to sleep up high. Cats who live in households with multiple cats often rotate sleeping spots at different times of day. Each cat will adjust where they sleep and when according to the schedule of the other cats. Wild cats sleep just as much as domestic cats. Cats are natural predators who require short bursts of energy to stalk and pounce on their prey. To have these energy reserves, they sleep a lot. But they don't just sleep to gain energy, they sleep to conserve it. In the wild, cats have no way of knowing how much time will pass between meals. Even if they are actively hunting, they aren't always successful. Sometimes, they require enough energy to hunt for days in between meals. So, when they are well-fed, they sleep. Lions sleep anywhere from 15 to 20 hours per day, with females sleeping slightly less than males due to their cub-rearing responsibilities. Interestingly, wild cats spend a lot more time social sleeping than domestic cats. 
Because they live in groups, they spend about 10% of their sleep time in physical contact with other cats. Only 2% of domestic cats engage in this behavior. It is, however, possible that the reason most domestic cats don't sleep socially is that many of them live as the only cat in the home. House cats also don't need to protect themselves from predators while napping, so they don't require the protection of others. Cats can dream. It is widely believed that cats do dream, even though there have been no recent studies done specifically on cats. The most widely referenced study conducted on cats' dreaming behavior was done by Michel Jouvet in 1979. He conducted numerous studies about cats and reported observations of cat actions during sleep. The observed cats performed many complex behaviors during REM sleep, including stalking, attacking, grooming, and flight behavior. However, many of the experiments Juve conducted can't be replicated, as many would be considered inhumane by today's standards. If you observe your cat sleeping, you'll notice that there are times when their eyes blink, their ears twitch, and their toes and nose move. This is evidence that they are in the REM stage of sleep. It's also quite likely that they are dreaming. What they dream about is anyone's guess. Changes in your cat's sleeping patterns can indicate a health issue. Cats are stoic creatures and they're famous for hiding illnesses and injuries. Cats who are sick or hurt like to hide rather than show us there's something wrong, so it's up to us to pay attention. Even small changes in sleep patterns can indicate a problem. If your cat is suddenly sleeping less or more than usual, it's time to pay attention. Sometimes, sleep patterns are disrupted by temporary changes in a cat's daily schedule. Changes like moving, adding family members, the loss of a family member, including other animals, a change of seasons, especially the arrival of spring, or even changes in your work schedule can throw a cat's routine off. These types of changes usually require an adjustment period of a couple of weeks, after which your cat will go back to their routine. If there have been no changes in your house, it's time for a vet visit. Sleeping too little or too much may be a sign your feline friend isn't feeling well. Extreme sleepiness can be caused by arthritis, hypothyroidism, diabetes, or kidney disease. Hyperthyroidism and feline influenza virus can cause your cat to be restless and unable to settle down to sleep. Cats have an ideal sleep temperature. Most of us are aware that turning down the thermostat helps us sleep better. The recommended ideal temperature for sleep is 68 degrees Fahrenheit or 20 degrees Celsius. Cats also have an ideal sleep temperature, and it's much higher. Our feline companions are most comfortable in warm temperatures. 80 degrees Fahrenheit or 27 degrees Celsius is where they are most comfortable. This is why you might find your cat napping close to heat sources like furnace vents or sunny windows. Cats regulate their body temperature through their sleeping position. When cats are cold, they curl up tight into a ball. If they're too warm, they stretch out. Hot and humid summer day? You're likely to find your cat napping on their back with their belly exposed to release excess body heat. Cats are known to play favorites. Surprisingly, our felines are naturally attracted to some people but not others. So check out this video where we talk about how cats pick their favorite human and how to make sure it's you. And be sure to subscribe to our channel and join our feline-loving community.